Hello, ladies. Hi. Hey, Paige, what's that noise? Uh, that would be rain. I wish I could sign. Are you, are, are you doing, are you, are you doing King Lear here? Or the Titanic, one of the two. Oh my gosh. Amazing wow. effects here in New when we say theater in the park, we're not really we're not really out in the open air though. Oh my gosh! Yeah. No, but we have a yeah. roof over our heads. We do have a roof over our heads. All right, take two. <laughs> Hello, ladies. Are you dry? We're dry. Still dry. So far. Um, Paige Price, Joan Hess. I'm gonna let you uh, both tell tell our viewers what your connection to theater Aspen is. Paige. I'm the artistic director. In 2007, I came here as an actor, and then I took over the artistic director position. This is my third season. And tell people what Theater Aspen is. Theater Aspen is um, a professional theater up in the Rockies, in Aspen, obviously. And um, we have 153 seats. We do a re summer repertory, and yeah. we also have education programs, which we do all year round under um, in a building. Um, <laughs> and uh, and so we're an equity theater. We also have uh, programs for the locals, and yeah. we try to get as much programming in the summer as possible. And you bring in some hot shots from New York, like <laughs> Joan has. Hello, Joan. Hi. Um, this is your second s second summer at Theater Aspen. T yeah. Tell, look tell us, I. brag a little bit about some of your uh, Broadway work, <laughs> shall you? Uh, shall I? Uh, sure. Re more recently, I did uh, Mamma Mia on Broadway, and I did shows like Kiss Me Kate and Dirty Rotten Scoundrels and Bells Are Ringing and Crazy for You, and I was on Flight of the Concords on HBO, and yeah. you know, I've gotten to do some fun stuff. But I have to say. Coming to Theater Aspen these two summers has really been a highlight. It's amazing. Yeah. I think we do. I think we're doing some amazing theater, and I'm really grateful to Paige for, you know, making it possible. So to you, be out you're, here you're all highfalutin and all that, but where were you born? <laughs> In Pueblo, Colorado. See, you're one of See? us. I'm totally one of you. <laughs> there you go. Well, I worked at Boulder Stinner Theater. It was my first professional job. Yeah. And I did several shows there, and I worked at Country Dinner Playhouse. That's where I got my equity card doing a play there. <laughs> And, uh, and I worked, gosh, I worked at Denver Civic Theater in Denver Center, and I came back and worked at Denver Center uh, Theater doing, what's it called? The, the Galleria. The Galleria. Came back and did shows at the Galleria. And Arvada Center, I worked. Uh, and Golden with your sister. And at Heritage, Heritage. Square. Oh, you were. All right, well, they're flashing because they want the show to start. Yeah, um, it's better than lightning. Um, <laughs> what, 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 <laughs> Paige, what were we about to see? We're about to see The Marvelous Wonderettes. Starring another uh, woman that we know. Who's that? Yes, Beth Malone. She's a Snowmass native. And um, actually, I'm not sure she was born there, but she born Castle Rock. Rock. Right. Yeah. And so she has a home out here, and she she yeah. helped me program this season. Let's yeah. just say it. That. That's right. That's right. She was in the original New York cast. She was. I saw her there before she was in Spelling Bee last year. Right. I saw her in Marvelous Wonderettes. And she did a bazillion shows at the Country Dinner Playhouse, as did your sister. Please. Yeah, in fact, the one show I was in at Country Dinner Playhouse, I did with Beth. We did Steel Magnolias together. Oh, nice. Stop it. Yeah, that would be fun, fun. to do. And yeah, tell and tell people who your who your uh, who your sister is. Lisa Sims. See another another and name another we remember from the past. Yeah, yeah, and now an LA actress. Yeah, nice. Uh, okay, Paige, just for fun, word association on a day like today. <laughs> if I just mention the name Charlie Sheen. <laughs> Um, what, what thoughts go through your mind? Uh, smoker? <laughs> <laughs> if people don't know what we're talking about, this almost became the summer that you got assigned Charlie Sheen for community service. He would have gotten you coffee, I think. Oh, excellent. I think that she would have liked that. Yeah, <laughs> right. I could take that. I have I a lot of envelopes that need licking. <laughs> <laughs> God, yes. Um, are you feeling like you dodged a bullet there a little bit? Uh, yeah, yeah. Is everything got delayed, and if it's delayed again, that would be okay too. Yeah. All right. Tell people uh, how long you're going to be open for this summer, so that they can come see your shows. Our final show happens on the 22nd of August. Everything runs in repertory till then, and then we take our tent down for good. And what can we see Joan in this summer? Joan is in Same Time Next Year, a romantic comedy. She's a two-hander, so she carries half that show on her back, and it's a romantic comedy that is just heartwarming and funny and beautiful and a great part for her. Oh, thanks. Excellent. It's really fun. Thanks for spending some time with us, ladies. Thank Good you, time. Sean. Stay dry. Yeah.